we're done and this is Simon Green and we're going to sing Proud Boy on the Bandwagon TV today. <laughs> someone that will put up a fight for them in a relationship so it's a love song and kind of a different spin on that and it's not on this is my current album called another land and it has four of my own songs and seven covers and it was launched into the midlands as kind of a, an ep for my own material and went fairly well so I'm happy with that and um, looking forward to recording new stuff now including maybe proud boy Okay, so we're lucky um, we were able to sing that song today because we were in Drogheda last night in the Punt Bar, the Purple Sessions, and it was great crack up there last night. Um, and we have a good lot of gigs coming up over Christmas and they'll all be on MySpace, um, Eve we're done. And um, kind of focusing a lot on recording at the moment, uh, recording a demo for new material and also for, we play with a tribe band as well, there's two um, Irish musicians who play with us. So we do a lot of gigs in that line, it's a good lot over Christmas. And uh, I just finished recording uh, two Christmas songs as well for promotional purposes in Penny Lane Studios in Tullamore. So looking forward to, to getting that out as well. 
Well, I moved to Leash from Dublin about two and a half years ago now, and um, I was playing in, uh, in various rock bands in Dublin, playing guitar, playing bass, and kind of got in, into the production end of it as well. But I got in touch with Emer through MySpace, I heard her stuff on MySpace, I was very impressed with that, and met her, I arranged to meet her in a gig she had, was doing on a Sunday night in Lethian Bar on Main Street in Port Leash, and just got chatting after that, and um, we kind of found we had similar influences for the folk music that we play, and and um, found that our styles and guitar worked very well together. We just took it from there and started writing. I unfortunately didn't know her while she had uh, she had started promoting the album. She had recorded it and started promoting it. So I wasn't actually, uh, I wasn't on the sessions of the album, but since then I helped her tour the, the album when she did launch it into the Midlands and yeah, the enjoyed it then and just pretty much took it from there. Well, my influences, I have lots of different genres of music that I Got, was involved in. I started off with a lot of Irish traditional music and then I did a lot of musicals and um, got into writing my own material then and I suppose they all kind of combined and I listened to lots of different people like Sinead O'Connor, Eva Cassidy, um, lots of bands like Snow Patrol, Kings Leon and um, loads, of, loads of different influences and then Simon has so much different influences as well that the two of them just kind of seems to work well together. We got the opportunity to play with a lot of well-known acts recently, which was fantastic. We got to play with John Spillan a couple of times here in the Thatch in Rahan and in uh, the Passion Food Theatre in Athlone as well. And with uh, Mick Hanley, we played with him a few weeks ago as well, well-known um, folk singer-songwriter. And Freddie White and Keela and a lot of different people like that. So looking forward to now playing with, with other well-known acts too. It's great for someone who's, who's getting going to, to play with people who are well known already, such as themselves. So.